EPA is supposed to be more anti-inflammatory for the body, right? DHA is more skewed for the brain. First off, you typically wanna be leaning towards one that's higher DHA, skewed a little bit more towards the DHA side. So if you're looking at a label, if you're like, a thousand milligrams EPA and a hundred milligrams DHA or something like that, that's a pretty bad ratio. I try to get that DHA content up and it's usually indicative of the quality of the fish oil too as sort of a backdoor way of saying that. Basically you can see if it's gonna be high EPA and low DHA, unless you have a very specific use case for EPA only, it doesn't make any sense. The whole idea of getting fish oil for the most part, it's cardiovascular health yeah. and brain benefit. What's the ratio of the one that you're using right now? So I try to find like a one-to-one -one or typically, personally, I use cod liver oil. 